SR5 versus the TRD off-road. Two wins it. Let's go, Johnny. Let's go, Johnny. No, no, no. Let's go. Well, this is a great day to go out off-road. Awesome, awesome weather. Pulling up to meet everyone right now, and the weather is a lot better over here, that's for sure. So we've made it. This is sick. First time in Johnson Valley. Let's go. What's up, baby? Dude, Johnson Valley is is insane. This is I know I know we went to Anza, but this is like a whole nother level. This is like this is like whoop city. This is like jump city. We're gonna have a fun time. Did right I now. see a tailgate delete on your tundra? Yeah, yeah. I <laughs> deleted my tailgate, and it's just adding a bunch of weight in the back because these trucks really like to have weight. If I didn't have anything on this, the back would just be bouncing yeah. all over, right? But it compresses and it wants to buck up. Because there's a lot of weight there, it doesn't go as high. Let's see if it hit this line. Yeah. All righty. All right. Hey guys. <laughs> Feeling brave, Mike? Riding the full Mac Tundra there. All right. I'm about to drive. All right, you're on your own. That was amazing. Like, what the? I'm, I'm shocked. So, no words. I, I, if I could think of one, I'd say it. But you see what I was talking about? Yeah. There? When it bucks up, it right? controls. It's control when it lands. That's, that's, that's the important part. I just, I, I just don't have enough travel in the back. Got You're a little taller today. now too. I hit my growth spurt. Who'd have known that red and lunar went so well together? You know another lunar rock that has that? I do not. Not another. You're one. Of, you're one of one. Look at this. We've got the dog riding shoddy right and the now, humans yeah. in the back. Let's go. <laughs> Cashy. Hey dude. Riding shotgun. Nice and comfortable. All right. All right. Outside out. Let's go. And we are out. Me, TRD John, and Fur Runner are the ones stuck in the back because we are the no chase light crew, unlike everyone else up there. So. We're riding in the uh, way in the back, back, but it's all good. We have cargo lights. John knows what's up. Your eye for visibility. If it starts getting dusty, just slow down, okay? Um, yeah. Happy that. Take your car. Already went out. Ah. Let's go. So we've come across a pretty steep climb here and we're gonna see how it goes. I think only I, lost all I think only one of us is two-wheel drive, and that's Brandon in the Tacoma right there. So I I think that's all we have in two-wheel drive, but it's still pretty steep. So we had two casualties already. Corey and Isaiah didn't make it. All right, so update, we couldn't make it up that hill. So all of us are on the racetrack right now trying to get off this thing as soon as possible. I'm getting left in the dust. Everyone's way up there. So right now we're dealing with a lot of uh, race traffic. So we're going off the grid now to make sure we're not in their way. So we're just cutting through. entirely sure what to expect from uh, this run and it is 90% whoops so getting a good feel for how this thing does in the whoop section but so far so good my boy Mike hit the mud I didn't hit it I tapped it <laughs> it's my tap dude <laughs> so it's times like this when you're hitting the whoops for like 30 minutes straight that you understand how nice it'd be to have the new seats on the 24 Tacoma TRD Pro after like 30 minutes of this or however long, you might start to feel it in your back and your neck and everywhere else too. I'm getting old. It's hit 40 and I'll slow it down. Maybe because we're getting a little rocky. So I have two goals for today. One of them is to uh, race one of the third gen tenders that we have um, with the new Tacoma here and see who's faster. Goal number two. Ooh. My other goal is to uh, get airborne today. I'm not too sure how well you guys can tell, but it, it's the winds are insane right now, so there's no chance of getting outside and doing any any form of filming yeah, at all. But um, TRD John just told me that he uh, 
he's behind me right now and he was like dude your, your back end came off the ground a few times so yeah the whip sections out here are pretty pretty intense but a lot of fun though yeah buddy there's nothing more fun to me than getting out here in the open desert and just pushing your build to its absolute limits. You get why people spend the money they spend on their builds. Once you get them out here and push them to the extreme, it's just there's nothing more fun than that. And combine that with some good people and some sick builds, it's a good day, dude. I'm having a lot of fun right now, despite all these insane whoops, which is actually really funny being behind TRD John because just like he was saying about me, he is getting the back end absolutely bucked, which is really funny to see. So yeah, it's whoopy out here, dude. That is an absolute fact. Just put in perspective how windy it is out here. There you guys have it. What do you say, Isaiah? We do a one-on-one, -on -one, me and you. I'm really, right now? I'm super curious, dude. Okay, let's go. Let's run it. 24 Tacoma versus 22 Tundra SR5. All three of us? All three of us, I'm in. I'm in on it, let's go. 224 Tacomas. Hey, is the hybrid Tundra in here too? Yeah. Well, we're gonna find out. Oh no, Joey ain't in it. All right. Let's run it. Let's go, baby. Let's go, baby. Let's go. Oh, no way. No way, no way. Okay, well, I don't know. Let's do it again. On three, go. Okay, all you. That's right, baby. Let's go, baby. Let's go, bring it home. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Not today, bro. Oh, 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 that was sketchy. That was sketchy. I didn't like that. Bro, what? Bro, what? That didn't count. That did not count, dude. Come on, I hit a thing. That did not count, dude. I hit a bump. <laughs> I had him too. Oh, that's going up. Bro, I had to let off that bump. I got airborne a little bit there, dude. All right, all right, we have to do it Run it back for sure, for sure. Yeah, definitely. Let's do this again. We're all lined up again. I think the Ram's hopping in too. Let's do this. No! He got the jump. He got the jump. No, 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 no! Let's go, baby. Let's go, let's go, let's go! Let's go! No! Dang it. He got me by a little bit. By a very, very little bit. We let the ram in the dust, but yeah, that's really close. Run it back and then best three out of five, maybe? <laughs> yes, sir. 
Yep. Let's go, baby. Let's go, boy. Let's go, boy. Let's go. <laughs> That's it. I took it. I took it. Let's go, baby. Oh, that's it. That was it. That was all me, baby. <laughs> Let's go. Let's freaking go, dude. That was it. That one was all me right there. I might have, I don't know. I might have got the jump on him. I'm not too sure. That was me. That's all I know. Sorry. Got a little excited there, but that was sick. You got me there, dude. I got you there, though. Last one. Let's go. Yeah. Let's go. That's it. That's all me. That's all me. That's all me. No, 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 no. That's him. He gains on me. Dude. It's close. Bro, the taco is fast. The taco is fast. You got that right. It's so weird seeing Tacomas be fast now. Like, I'm, I'm genuinely shot. <laughs> All right, so now it's time for a one-on-one -on -one with me and TRD John, SR5 versus the TRD Off-Road. See who wins it. Ready? Let's go, Johnny. Let's go, Johnny. <laughs> Woo! Took the TRD off road. It was your your light bar, extra oh, weight. Yeah. yeah, that's what it was. was. Much better in four high. Yeah, are got we that right. Race back or are you good? Uh, what? Are we, we going to race back or are you good? Uh, absolutely. <laughs> Let's go! Let's go! Let's go, Johnny! As you guys just seen, I am casually undefeated against the 24 Tacoma TRD Off-Road on 34s. I am the 24 Tacoma SR5 on 35s. Undefeated, baby. Let's go. When me and TRD John were in Arizona, I mentioned that it looks really funny having him behind me because it's a twin build pretty much. He has bronze wheels and a zero degree slider, minor 20. But the wheels being, I mean, bronze out here, they're all dirty, so it doesn't really matter anyways. But um, yeah, and he has lights on the roof rack, but it's kind of the only difference. Otherwise, twin builds, having them behind me, it's like watching my truck in the mirror. And I gotta say, man, it's pretty good. There's quite a fun factor to driving through these, you know, pretty smooth lines at like 40, 45, 50. And, you know, it's overall pretty smooth. And then you approach something that is pretty questionable and you wonder if you should send it through or if you should slow down. And most often times you gotta just power through it. And the outcome is always a very curious thing, but that's the fun part. Alrighty, and we're all airing up right now. It is the end of our day. <laughs> Leaving just in time. Dude, the weather's been all over the place today. So coming up here, it was pouring rain. And then getting in there, it was sunny and hot. And then, uh, yeah, then it got really windy and cold. And now the rain's coming back. And then after that, it's blue skies. I don't know, dude. Oh, oh my gosh, this is nuts. My windshield wipers can't even keep up. Just my luck, so close to my freeway transfer and there's a police standoff shutting down the entire freeway. Sick. All right guys, so it is the next day over here and I'm currently at Costco getting some fuel because some days I just like choosing violence, I guess, but yeah, I'm here to fill up. I also, side note too, I have nearly 4,000 miles on this truck already, 3864 at this very moment in time, which is kind of a lot for how little I've owned this truck. So anyways, yeah, I've been driving everywhere to get this done and that done. And yeah, just going from there to here and here to there. So yeah, we're here at Costco. And then from here, I'm gonna go to the car wash because 
This thing is absolutely covered in filth inside now. All right, guys, so here at the car wash to get this thing all rinsed off. Now, some of you guys mentioned, why not do this at home and buy a pressure washer and make life a lot more convenient doing this at home. And the main reason for me coming here is because they have the proper drainage here as we're at my house, um, you know, washing all this excessive filth off, all the muddy stuff and just all the dirt at my house is not super ideal because it would leave all this stuff on the grounds of my community. As we're here, I could rinse this off and it goes into the proper drainage right there. So when it's like this, I come here for the washes. If it's just kind of routine wash stuff, not super filthy like it is right now, then I'll do that at home. But yeah, it's, it's pretty bad right now. So we come here to the coin wash for that. Got her all cleaned up, looking good from afar, but far from good, that's for sure. This thing is still all caked up, but good enough for uh, for now, until we get it home and finish the job. And at this point too, as you guys can see, pretty much every wheel has damage on it in some fashion or another. I think this one back here is a new one from yesterday, but it's all good. That race was epic between me, Tiority John, and Isaiah, full Mac Tundra. And of course we had uh, Mike in the mix as well with the Ram. Now between me and Isaiah, um, so he got me on the first run, right? I had him on the second one, I did, until I had a bump and then I went airborne, things got really sketchy, so I had to call off that race. And so he obviously got me on that one. Third one, he had me, whatever. And then the fourth one, I had him. Let's go, baby, taking W's. But no, he's got, what, 100 more horsepower than me? He has the 22 Tundra SR5. Um, and so yeah, 100 more horsepower in that thing, about 160 more pounds of torque. Um, he is about a thousand pounds heavier. He has two full-size spares in the bed um, and a tailgate delete for what that's worth. And it was one versus one, me and TRD John and I, you know, off the rip, we were pretty neck and neck. And then the faster we both went was when I was able to gain on him more. So he has 34s. We have the same truck, by the way, too. We have the same Tacomas, the wheel and tires is the main difference and uh i'm on 35s he's on 34s uh my wheel and tire setup though is heavier than his by about 20 pounds so mine's heavier but they are taller as always hopefully you guys enjoyed stay tuned though because i'm ordering the wrap for the tacoma tonight so that'll be here sometime at midweek and then we'll get to uh um, starting the wrap on this thing and then tomorrow i'm going to start working on the tundra again in an attempt to get it back to a proper alignment and get that thing all dialed in see you guys on the next one very soon till then Peace out.